In this video, I'm going to tackle the burning question I hear many people ask. Is the Chanel wallet on chain right for me? Hi everyone, my name is Rachel and I'm a member of the Fashion File customer service team. I assist ultra luxury customers like you in finding their dream bags. Today, I'm going to walk you through the ins and outs of the Chanel wallet on chain, including the ways to wear it, what essentials you can stash inside, and the different styles you can shop for. Let's get into it. When the Chanel wallet on chain, also known as a walk, was first introduced in the late 90s, the style was a game changer as it blurs the lines between a wallet and a bag, so it feels like you're getting two in one. The classic walk features the iconic CC logo and a flap that folds over covering the entire front. Depending on the age of the bag, the flap can close with a press lock closure or a magnetic closure. The latter recently replaced the press lock on newer Chanel walks to help make opening and closing easier. Flip the bag around and you'll find a convenient back pocket. Opening the walk reveals a wallet wonderland. The classic walk has a multitude of card slots, interior pockets, and zippered compartments. My favorite is this zippered pocket located at the underside of the flap, which is a nod to the classic double flaps pocket intended for stashing away little love letters. You can wear the walk in so many different ways. The most common ways to wear it are as a crossbody or as a shoulder bag by wearing the strap like this. I'm 5'2 and the walk falls pretty far down because the straps are on the longer side. If you think that might be the case for you too, you can always wrap the strap around like this. If you want to adjust the strap even more, you can double them up like this and the walk becomes even shorter, allowing you to wear it on your shoulder or on your arm. Another way to wear it is as a wristlet by adjusting the straps like this. I love styling this bag this way, especially for dressier occasions. Okay, now that you know a little bit more about the ins and outs of the Chanel walk and the ways you can wear it, let's see what fits inside. Remember, this style is a wallet, so its primary purpose is to fit cards and IDs. But if you're curious about other basics that can fit inside, you can start by fitting in a card holder. I love putting this inside the front pocket for easy access. You can also store cash and any loose change inside the main zippered pocket. In the larger open compartment, you can fit your phone, lipstick, and keys too. I recommend a key holder to really keep things packed in. Or you could squeeze in a pocket agenda. This is great because Louis Vuitton agendas have card slots inside them, which gives you more places to store your cards safely. The slip pocket in the back is a great place for storing your receipts or tickets. Something I forgot to mention before is if you want to wear this bag as a clutch, you can fit the entire chain inside. Just remember, if you do wear it like this, you won't really be able to fit anything else other than your cards. I have to say, this bag is quite the chameleon. Over the years, the classic walk version has taken on the characteristics of a number of iconic Chanel bags, including the 255, the Chanel 19, the trendy bag, and the boy bag, just to name a few. The walk world is truly your oyster. Which one would you pick? At the end of the day, when it comes to deciding if the Chanel walk is right for you, I recommend sticking to a few golden rules. Versatility. A neutral color that pairs with everything and a timeless style. The Chanel walk is a great timeless choice and not only one of Chanel's most popular bags, but also a more budget-friendly option with tons of colors to choose from. When you're ready to shop, you can find great deals through resale at Fashion File. Would you buy one? And that concludes today's video on the Chanel Wallet on Chain. I hope this was helpful for anyone trying to decide if this bag is right for them. If you already own the walk, what do you enjoy most about it? I would love to know. Also, it would mean a great deal if you could like this video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Be sure to hit the bell icon below to be notified of future videos. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.